Okay, guys, we're back to episode 5. Um, the spiders are... I did heal up, but then I opened this up and got attacked by another spider, which poisoned me, and I probably just got poisoned again. Oh, dear God. I don't know what to do about these spiders, because they're everywhere. Get battle ch battle signed. <laughs> And I don't know where they're spawning from, either. Like, at least if I knew that, I could do something about it. Okay, they don't seem to be spawning around here. So I'm going to stand here. <laughs> and not move too far. But there does seem to be diamond everywhere. So, that's cool. And did I see more land over there? I don't know. I can't tell. Look at all the experience all over the ground. Okay, oh, I need to eat. Do I have anything better? Like, yeah, bread. I don't want to waste a full mushroom stew if I don't have to. Okay, it's a regular spider. I can deal with regular spiders. <laughs> Stupid freaking cave spiders. I don't know where they're coming from, because I only saw the one spawner. I mean, I'm sure there's another one somewhere. I just don't know where. And why am I lagging so bad? Oh, jeez. Okay, that was weird. I got like a still frame of that skeleton. Okay, well, let's grab this Estonian battle sign. Looting? All right! <laughs> I don't know what good that'll do me, but still! It'll help me get arrows. Ow. No, no, no. And apparently, tons of string. Yeah, I have to kill them with the Zestonian battle sign to actually have it make them drop looting stuff, though. <coughs> okay, where's the spot? There it is. I wonder if it counts killing them with the fire from the sign. I don't know, but yeah, you can tell that I've, I'm getting some good loot with this uh, sign here. I love how he's got the, the enchanted sign. I think that's awesome. Okay, that's where I was before, where I followed it around to the end with all the lapis. So, let's come over here. And, oh, Creeper blew up some diamond. I mean, not like it really matters, we've got tons of it here. But, ow. Quit it, you jerk face. Ah. Stop it. No, I said stop it! This is actually a good weapon. Because it lights things on fire and they drop tons of stuff when you kill them with it. I don't know what this was over here. I just found it. Was it me attempting to block things off so they wouldn't kill me? <laughs> Alright. So, we need more torches. And I have no more coal. So, oh hey look, coal. <laughs> How convenient. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Okie dokie. There we go. And. Well, oh, I already had some. And I'll grab another one to put on this stick because I don't like having extra sticks just lying around. <laughs> Um, let's see, I don't want that. I don't want that. Keep that. Keep that. Don't need the signs. Um, Alright, that's good. Just in case I want to make some TNT, I'm going to hang on to that uh, gunpowder. Because, I mean, you know, you never know when you need TNT. What was that? Oh, it was just the wall. Alright. The wall showed up for a second, and I was like, um... Because <laughs> it disappeared almost immediately, so... I was a little confused. It's good, and my armor's still uh, doing pretty well, considering how much we've gone through in the past who knows how long. Is there something behind me? No. They're all fighting each other. <laughs> wow, that skeleton dropped so many bones and arrows. Quit it. Look, look at that. That's ridiculous. I mean, I'm sure there's a chance for me to drop, or for things to drop, like, 
three times as much stuff with looting three, but um, still, it just seems like so much. Nope, you guys can back up. Thanks. I almost feel like the um, the Zestonian battle sign should have more powerful stuff as it goes on, because like it's always had knockback too, and then it got fire aspect, and then um, sharpness. You know, but if it went from, like, if it started at knockback one, and then when it gained fire aspect, it also got, um, knockback three. You know what I mean? What's all this dirt? It's weirding me out. Oh god, I'm scared. Whoa! Okay! Nope! Nope! That's going down! That's going down now. <laughs> we can do without blazes now, thank you. I know it doesn't light them on fire, but it does um, damage them with the sharpness part. And it, get no bad blazes. Uh, and the knockback is enough to get them away from me, so they can't murder me. <laughs> God, I can't believe he put blaze spawners in here. <laughs> like, I mean, I guess it makes sense. I just wasn't expecting it. No. Okay, murder that one. Run over here. Get rid of the spawner. Any more? Any more? Doesn't look like it. Was that like the sole purpose of all this dirt? Just to put the blaze spawners on? I mean, maybe it was so that you could farm blaze rods, but I don't want blaze rods. I don't need potions of strength. Or ender eyes. Or a brewing stand. And, uh... I don't have any slimes, so I can't make magma cream to make um, fire resist potions. So, really, that would have been totally useless. What's in the hole? Nothing? Alright. I just wanted to see if there's anything interesting under the dirt. See, they dropped so much stuff. I get tons of arrows now. I should say I get tons of arrows now, not I. I've got tons of arrows. Well, I do have a bunch of arrows, too, but the point was that I get a bunch now. <laughs> Whenever I kill um, skeletons, they just drop like crazy. Alright, we got lava over here. I still have no idea where... Oh, that would probably be where I need to go. Over there. Oh, it looks fun. That's for sure. Oh, God. No, stop lighting me on fire. Oh, good, he hit the creeper. So the creeper's gonna run at him and blow up. There we go. Oh dear. Oh well. Okay, well, that looks like where I need to go. So, uh, yeah. This area is relatively safe. Um. Let's see. I think I can make it all the way across without killing myself? Let's find out. <laughs> this will be interesting. Hopefully I can. Hopefully there's no gas spawners right on the coast. Or, um, blaze spawners, even. Just anything that shoots things, really. I hope there's not spawners for on the end there. And I need to be careful not to look at any endermen, because if they teleport on me, I'm pretty much dead, no matter what. Oh boy, I don't like this lag that seems to be appearing. And I definitely do not like standing here like this. It's just that I don't have any more stone. Should I try to goad some creepers into attacking me, or should I just mine and to like blow up large amounts of stuff, or should I just mine it? Yeah, I'll just mine it. Actually, I'll I'll mine this stuff and then I'll be back so that I'm not wasting all your time. All right, guys. Um, I made a little home here. <laughs> There's a little bridge that I was building. Um, I made some new armor because there was I was mining a bunch of stone up here, and there was just a big thing of diamonds. So I was like, you know, why not? Might as well because it was already half gone, and I just threw the rest of the, the, the uh, armor in lava. <clears throat> and, uh, yeah, so I'm almost at the end of the video, so I figured I'd cut it here before we actually get across. Um, or, well, end of the section, at least. I think this is section part two? Part two? Uh, something like that. So, um, yeah, part two. So, I'm going to... Um, I was going to wait until nighttime. I mean, yeah, so I could sleep and reset my spawn. And yeah, I'm I'm gonna st I'm just gonna do that. So um, 
I have to pause the video anyway, so I'm going to wait until nighttime and then sleep just so I can set my spawn over here where it's close to the to where I am now so I don't have to run who knows how long to get here. So uh, I'll see you in a second. Alrighty, so I just slept and uh, I went out and killed a little bit of stuff and lit up some areas and grabbed a bunch of diamonds and put them in the chest just so that I'd have them. Um, and uh, now let's go. And this is part two, so the last one was part one. Um, I don't know why I thought it was part two. I don't know. Guys, it's it's so hard for me to keep track, especially because I'm doing three parts per episode. So, um... It's like, I'm not just trying to keep track of which episode I'm on, I'm also trying to keep track of which part of which episode I'm on. And it can get kind of annoying sometimes, so... Okay, I may also make this... Um, okay, gotta make sure I'm holding down shift. <laughs> I might just, oh geez, there's lava pits everywhere. I may go, oh dear. That's, get back, get back. Okay, what is this? Get. Wildfire, center of chaos, DFK. Diamond, oh, DFK, diamond fire knockback. Gotcha. All right. Well, that's good to know. I've got a nice sword now. Fire aspect and knockback. Um, I suppose I didn't need to make all those diamond swords then, way back then. But um, oh well. This, these holes in the ground are freaking me out. I really need to be careful and watch where I'm stepping. They don't seem to go to lava now, though. Oh. Owie. My torches. So this is pretty much... it's Yeah, the uh, fire aspect and knockback were pretty much the only reason that I used the... Uh, the Zestonian battle sign. But, I mean, it's still a nice tool to have, because especially if I, I want to fight some Endermen, because I can just get like a bunch of Ender Eyes all at once. Which are actually pretty useful for teleporting, because I used them recently in my Let's Play world. Um, or I used one recently in my Let's Play world. Because I, I died in the Nether way down really low, and because um, I was actually mining out a bunch of Nether, rack, or nether Brick sorry for um, from one of the Stronghold, or the Stronghold, I should say. Uh, the one that we've been using. And, um, what is that? Oh, dear God, that's a gas spawner. Oh, dear God. Okay, yep. I don't... No! Where did you come from? <laughs> there was nothing here a second ago. Get! I do have more stone in my inventory, so... Oh, dear God! Oh, God! Oh, God! <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> oh god. That was scary. Okay. Um So that gas spawner is going to cause me problems. Stupid skeleton, get out of here. Hey, I hit him. And now he's on fire. Can have a piece of this battle sign. Seriously though, I love the battle sign vex. If you're watching this, which I might like send it to you or something and uh because it'd be awesome if I could get um, a video up on his... Because I know sometimes he puts uh, Let's Plays of his videos, or like playthroughs of his videos on his page. If I could get one of those, that'd be fantastic. Um, that'd be really cool, because I've never had a video like featured before, so... Um, but, ow! No, get back! No, no, no! <laughs> Don't look at me! I'll stab your feet! Okay, so... Um, clearly, climbing up the side, not the way to go. Oh, where is it? Yeah, it's up there. No, stop it. What? They can shoot through that? They should not be able to blow up stone brick. That's ridiculous. Should we try this again? <laughs> I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Um, because I know, like, it seems like all of the spawners are prepped so that they spawn instantly when you um, get close enough to one. 
which is kind of annoying, and quit it! You're blowing holes, all, all kinds of holes in this tower here. Oh, that missed. Oh, hey, I hit it. Quit moving. Okay, this gas is going to get really annoying really fast. <laughs> Uh, I say that like it's not already annoying. I didn't mean to put that block down, but I don't have time to mess with it. Quit shooting at me! I hate you! Okay. Okay, let's use this as a little entrance here and see if there's anything inside here. It sounds... Oh, dear God. So oh, dear God. <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> okay, okay. Yep, they're just going to keep coming now. Oh dear god, this is this is awful. No, I just I just wanted to get inside. Why do you hate me? Die. Oh my god, the experience. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Where's my Oh, I don't have my uh flint and steel, so I can't light the ground on fire. I was just going to have them walk through fire. Just all of them. Just walk through the fire. No big deal. They probably kill most of them, so... Unfortunately, the silverfish don't drop anything. These are silverfish if you've never seen them. Normally they spawn in dungeons, which is why they're coming out of the, this brick here. Because the brick itself is actually a, um, a trap block. Okay, that was supposed to hit them all. <laughs> or not hit me, I should say. I don't know why I said hit them all instead. Okay. Is there no just nothing in there? It's just a tower with gas spawners on it? Okay. I ate something, that's good. And gas is murdering things, that's good too. Except I hate this thing! What, was that a freaking silverfish all the way over here? How did that even happen? Is, if there's silverfish spawners all over the place, then I'm gonna cry. Okay, out of the fire. Get that gas! How is that gas not dead? Oh my god, so many mobs. I need to kill that gas, but I need to kill these other things first. Look at the big holes in the... Uh Freaking, oh my god, so much experience. It's all over the place. Okay, so I'm getting the area lit up, which is good, because that means, oh my god, it's like killing a silverfish just immediately makes all of the nearby silverfish traps break, apparently. Because when I kill one, like three more spawn out of this freaking tower of doom here. It's like, seriously. Yeah, see, look, I kill one, and a whole line of blocks there just falls apart and silverfish pour out. Do they even hurt? <laughs> they don't. I don't know why I'm freaking out about them then. Is it just like if they hit you in the head? Because I know Etho said something about, I think it was Etho, uh, said something about slimes not being able to hurt you if they can't get your head. Oh my god, so much experience from this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all of them! Oh my god! Okay, you! Hit that creeper. There you go. Look at all the experience. This is ridiculous. Okay. I can't build up. Because I want to take down that gas spawner, but I can't build up because there's silverfish at my feet. And killing them just makes more spawn. I'll just kill them with my battle sign. <laughs> Probably does just as much damage with the sharpness 3. And uh, doesn't waste durability on my sword. Ok, 
Okay, we need to light up this area some more. This is ridiculous. Oh, jeez, I need to eat. No wonder I can't sprint. I'll just eat while I'm being pushed around by some silverfish. Okay, looks like it's calmed down a little bit. Yeah? Alright, well, I have to pause the recording and get to part three. So, I'll be right back. Alright. <clears throat> okay, so. Uh, what were we doing? We're trying to get... I want to get on top of that. There's another spawner there, but I don't know what it spawns. Get. You're just causing trouble. Stupid skeleton. Whoa, leggy leggy. <laughs> Look at all the experience. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Yeah, I think it's when they can hit your head. They can damage you. Your fire. If I break this, are silver or silverfish gonna fall out? Yep. <laughs> Why do I hear fire? Are there blaze spawners in there? Because I really hope there aren't. Okay, you know what? Let's just climb up to the top. the victory pen. Alright, so this is where I need to get pigs to. <laughs> and there is a blaze spawner. Down there. Alright. Um. No, we don't need that. <laughs> That's for sure. We do not need a blaze spawner messing with us right now. Okay, I just want, I want to get back up, but I don't want to have this ugly dirt sticking out the side. Because <laughs> I'm weird like that. So, okay, the victory pen is up here. Which means... It, I don't know how I'm going to get back up, though. So I'm going to search behind the tower, all the way around this little island here. Because I'd like to see what it's got contained inside. Or not inside, but, you know, on. Whoa, whoa, whoa! No! <laughs> what? What is happening? <laughs> Why are these cobblestone blocks turning into traps? No, stop it! Like, for some reason, these cobblestone blocks have become, um... Silverfish spawning blocks. Which shouldn't happen. Ever! Okay, you're making me angry now. Here we go. How did that one? Oh, Blaze must have killed it. I don't care if I'm on fire. You're going down. Fine, the last one will be an arrow. Here we go. Okay, there's just silverfish everywhere. There's got to be, like, silverfish spawners somewhere here. You think there's something out there? This is the far side of it. Oh, be careful for the holes. No, don't push me. Get. Oh, it looks like that's the bedrock wall. How pro am I? Oh, yeah, I'm pro. Is that the bedrock wall? Yeah, that's the bedrock wall. Alright. So this is the back of the map. Um, let's see. So this is the victory pen. And we're going to have to use... um. Minecarts to get the beer, the piggets, because there's no way those piggets are getting here without one. <laughs> like I'm pretty sure it would literally be impossible to do without um, you know. Okay, you guys can stop that now. 
These guys are great for experience. Because <laughs> they all seem to drop a decent amount. Okay, so let's see. I'm going to need a bunch of iron in order to do this. If I leave, will these things despawn? Because, <clears throat> I mean, most things will despawn if you just leave the area. I'm kind of surprised nothing else is spawning here. Like, it's all silverfish. Maybe it's just we've reached the cap. So, with all these silverfish, so they just aren't spawning because there's no more space for other mobs to spawn. Hmm. Looks like this island is pretty much empty except for that... Oh, I gotta get that gas spawner. I should have gotten it while I was up there, but I guess I forgot. Let's use sand. Mostly because I can just easily get it back if I, um... If I need to. Oh, gotta make more mushroom stew. Stop pushing me! Ow! Jerk! Oh god. <laughs> yeah, see, killing one just makes, like, a whole bunch more appear. Okay, well, it's nice. We've got a little break here because we've been doing so much trying to... so much fighting lately. And, uh, we finally got a chance to relax. Except I'm sure we're gonna... Dang it! I hate you! Stupid. Alright, um... So yeah, it seems like those spawners are, are prepped so that they, um... Oh, stop pushing me. There we go. Get! Uh, they look... They seem to be prepped so that they spawn as soon as you get in range. Um... So... That's good to note. Because both gas spawners and the blaze spawners, uh have all spawned things as soon as I get within range, or, like, almost immediately. Um, so, you know, it's good to keep that in mind. Uh, oh, look, some, some creepers spawned. And some zombies. That's weird. You know, um, in the rules it says not to go on top of the map, right? But I find that a little strange, because... Even if I went on top of the map, I wouldn't be able to get down here. Like, it would be one thing if I could just build a trail all the way across here, but you can't actually get down from up there. So, I don't see how that would be of any benefit to you to go on top of the map. Because, like, if I were to be able to, like, with the glass, I can just replace it with something and then um, put tracks down so I could bring the pigs from um, above the world. But, as it is, it's just like, you know, you know what I mean? I don't know. I don't even know what I mean, so how should I expect you to? Alright, um, <clears throat> looks like this, uh, let's, this playthrough of this map is going to finish soon, because, okay, you guys need to leave. Right now. <laughs> um, because soon I will be bringing the pigs over here, and we'll be done. So, I mean, then again, it is it is a long trek. I'll see if I can't get ten pigs in ten minecarts all lined up and then bring them all at once. But I may not be able to, so I'll have to do several trips. But I'll be recording the whole thing. I don't want to do, like, the only thing that I've done off camera so far is, like, build a boat one time and mine some stone so that you guys wouldn't have to see it. Because, um, you know, mining stone isn't exactly what you came for. So, uh, let's see. I'm going to have to make my way back now. Um, because I need to get a bunch of building materials and stuff. And, okay, you guys don't scare me anymore. I've got diamond armor and diamond sword that's, infl that's on fire and sends you flying, so I'm not really that scared of anything right now. Except for those cave spiders. Those things will end me. <laughs> because, the cave spiders and blazes, because, um, their damage bypasses armor. So, my... Diamond armor does nothing to stop a uh, blaze from killing me or uh, or the poison from the spider. I mean, the poison won't kill me, I don't think. I don't believe it can kill you, but um, it will take me down to half a heart, which means that... Uh, here, let me rephrase. It can't kill you, but it will bring you down to half a heart. So, um, 
You always need to be careful of that. What was he shooting at? Hey, no, get back. The Stonian battle sign! The Stonian battle sign! Oh, he's dead. Yeah, it doesn't look like the fire from the Zestonian battle sign activates the looting. So, um, that's unfortunate. So you actually have to hit them with the sign to kill them. But that's alright, because, I mean, that's pretty easy to do since fire doesn't do that much damage. Oh, hi, Creeper. Well, that helps a little bit. That zombie's gonna kill that skeleton. All the gunpowder I'm getting here. Okay. Now that they're dead. Um, oh, there we go. Well, I gotta end this video. So, um, hopefully episode 6. A, a half hour should be enough time to uh, bring the piggets all the way over here, right? Yeah, no way. Um, there'll probably be another two episodes while I get the iron and everything necessary to bring them all the way over here. But, uh, yeah. So I am going to end the recording here, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.